Uh, today, we're going to take a historic uh, step uh, towards passing legislation that will ban members of Congress uh, from trading stocks. This is the first time that a Senate committee is marking up legislation to tackle uh, this issue. Americans deserve to be confident uh, that their federal elected officials are making decisions that are in the best interest of the public and not their own personal interest. This legislation helps work towards that goal. Uh, this is a strong and bipartisan agreement. I was proud to lead uh, the effort to negotiate this updated bill, and I'd like to thank Senators uh, Merkley, Hawley, Ossoff, and Rosen uh, for their work uh, in putting this uh, together. This bill, which is uh, built off of Senator Merkley's Ethics Act, includes key provisions that will prohibit uh, bad actors from being able to take advantage of their positions for personal financial gain. The provisions include barring members of Congress, the President and Vice President from buying and selling a range of stocks and financial assets, requiring federal elected officials, their spouses and dependent children to divest from any banned assets beginning in 2027, and increasing the fines for violations of the Stock Act to $500. In other words, uh, I believe this is a uh, common sense uh, bipartisan agreement that strengthens accountability for the public and gives Americans the peace of mind that Congress is always, always working on their behalf. I'm committed to passing this bill and look forward to seeing it move uh, one step closer uh, to becoming law after this uh, morning's uh, action. I'd like to enter into the re uh, record a statement from Senator Merkley as well as letters from a number of uh, good government organizations in support of the bill. Without objection, I'll be entering in the record.